Hello and welcome back to Lost in Random. To what may be last or maybe second to last episode. Let's go ahead of ourselves and let's pick up another part of the story. And the children who rolled us. The headmaster showed no mercy. And the black dice hung. a sudden turn you know it is right. mm. really won't allow me to jump the way this was the last page we could get here which means if if it's like in I'm I'm supposed to find someone here <laughs> I, I don't know Dicey but I know they're here somewhere. You'll never break the spirit of the rebellion. Never. What? I did what I did for the rebellion. I regret none of it. Who are you? I am the Red Pawn, the leader of the famed rebellion of Fortown against the Queen and her vile No Dice War. True, I was captured. But you cannot kill an idea. Borberg will be victorious. Villainy can never triumph. You were from the original Fortown. My beloved motherland, tell me how fares Fortown? Do the valiant and true still call it home? Do the birds sing songs of its glory? What news have you? Tell me what became of Fortown. The original city is gone. I'm sorry, and it's now called Forberg. No, it's not possible. I, I don't, I can't. Forberg? Yep. And what of her people? There's a new city built on the ruins. Ah, you see, the city may be gone, but the spirit is thriving. Just as I may be rotting here in jail, but the rebellion lives on. Even though my city may no longer stand, its ideals always will. Huzzah! Huzzah, I say! You'll never break the spirit of the rebellion! Yeah, it's almost there! Almost there! Hail, kind soul! And well met! I'm a lost traveler from a distant land! Uh, I seem to have taken a wrong turn on my quest and lost my adventures cap. You haven't seen it, have you? No? Oh, Cedric would know just what to say right now. Freedom rules. As days bled into months, and then into years, this isn't what happens next, you know. Who are you? You are in the presence of the narrator of the Queen herself. Show some respect, child. The Queen imprisoned her own narrator. The Queen desires control. More than that, she desires not to be controlled. She reached a point where she thought I was controlling her. But you just know it, what she does. You're smarter than you look, child. Yes, that is true. But I could not convince her of that fact. Stories take us places, all of us, even narrators. And my place, it would seem, is in prison, where I can narrate only myself. Tell me all about the Queen. I could narrate volumes to you, child. But, like I said, that is not what happens next. Suffice it to say that when she was younger, the Queen then just a princess. She was happy. We were happy. There was such promise in her. 
A spark, ineffable. What happened next? Tragedy. Something unexpected. She tried to stop it, but... It is a tale long forgotten, and best left that way. Thanks for help. Oh, I haven't helped you at all, child. All I've done is narrate some backstory. Your fate is out of my hands. And from what I can see, I'm relieved it's so. I don't need your failure on my conscience. As days bled into months, and then into years, no one could say what would happen now, least of all me. I think it's one. In the cell. One thing was certain. The queen? Her story no had taken a very Why dark turn. I did something wrong. Whatever it was. And so Who I needed to be punished. They stored the bar. We by dying game. All this for this a little This was not what was supposed to happen. What happened? I'll tell you what happened. I was minding my business, and then Nanny Fortuna came, and I accidentally spilled some Zupa juice on her. That's it. But everybody loves Zupa juice. Right? And then she arrested me and brought me to the Queen. And then I maybe spilled some juice on her. Oh boy. Yeah, just a little. And then I tried to clean it up and kind of maybe spilled some more juice on her black dice and down her dress. That was two lifetime sentences extra right there. Where were you storing all oh, this juice? Mm, pockets, mostly. Cheeks, too. Built into hidden reservoirs in the top, too. Got my rung out of my hair. I'm a juicy boy. I'm not going to apologize for that. Anyway, that's my story. Remember me? My only regret is that I ceaselessly spilled so much super juice on authoritarian state makers. Like the boy, and all the fire, and all the data ball. You'll never break the spirit of the rebellion. Never. Did the boy, eh? Hey, boy, Stephen's narrator was so close, she just had to keep looking. Some part of Even knew her narrator was close. It was Even and her narrator were almost reunited. You sure? She was so close. She was Hello. so dramatically Look, close. You remember me, for I remember you. Shadowman? No. You leave me alone. And yet you were. The one who approached me. You're probably wondering why I'm here and not out there picking my teeth with the bones of the disobedient. I suppose it makes no difference to tell you. The Queen hired me all those years ago to kill that meddlesome King of Freedom and to start their war. Why would you do that, you monster? Oh, I was paid, but I would have done it for free. The Queen wanted to ensure his children would tear each other apart in the years and decades to come. And they did. I gave the Queen her endless war. I did brilliant work. But she played even me, you see. She promised me the people would fear the Shadow Man beyond reason. But they didn't. My rule was kept secret. And instead, they grew to fear war, their own deaths. And when I finally had enough, when I finally threatened to reveal the truth to everyone, well... Here I am. I pity you. You know, you never amounted to anything, and you never will. No, no, you don't get to pity me. I'm terrifying. 
You're terrified of me. Say it! Say you're terrified! Beautiful. You don't pity me? In fact, no. I pity you. You hear me? I pity you! I pity you! Nobody pities me! Nobody! Nobody! friend thank you for the rescue now i can get back to my job of narrating <clears throat> the narrator said narratively who are you i mean weird yeah it's uh, you there you are whoa, whoa, whoa wait you can hear me yeah this is new yet it isn't this is unprecedented but that doesn't mean it's bad <laughs> took the words right out of my mouth little one it was hard being alone i felt like half a person if that makes sense i felt your absence well <laughs> it would be strange if you didn't i am your narrator after all Oh, but it is nice to know when one's work is appreciated. But you can hear me now, and we should make the most of that while we can. One never knows how long it will be until the old authorities reassert themselves. We've got a quest to finish, my friend, and I stand ready to describe it if you stand ready to live it. Can you tell me? And I see what happen ne what happens next. Well, I'm afraid I can't even. I'm a storyteller, not an oracle. You and I see live your life. I describe it during moments chosen for dramatic effect, and together we'll make the best story we can. Yeah. I guess that makes sense. Wonderful. Then onward, even onward, Dicey. Now then, where were we? <clears throat> ah, yes. A girl, her dice, and her narrator were reunited at last. Behind them, the wreckage of all that had stood in their way. Ahead of them, the queen and her minions. Even squared her shoulders and strode forward toward her destiny. <laughs> oh, why, thank you. Yeah, but first things first. I have no idea where we should go. And there was a fight. to get me out of here. I'm a unicorn, a real live unicorn. The fuck? I think this is the way we should go. And if that's so, then... I can still collect money. <laughs> Is me of this one spoons? Freedom rules. Oh. Okay, so you meant it wasn't actually another way out of here. It was 
just another way to get through here. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So there is no free will. Can I move? Even please don't get stuck. We have a fight. Probably. This used to be a beautiful palace, a place of learning, of magic, of... Oh, yes, Dicey. It was also a place of dice. Go up? Should we go down? I have no idea which way we should go. Honestly, I'm just focused on looking for the last page. Halls that once echoed with the laughter of children were now still empty and desolate. Oh, right. Except for Even and her amazing friend Dicey, who was uh, great, did you say? You built a bad end, have you? Was, and I quote, great and awesome to the max. Connect. Sure, he does. No. What am I even doing? There's no more pages here. Don't ask me why. Oh, this was probably the last place we could go. That. Okay. It just occurred to me, it, it was very sudden, and I didn't expect that. I know who the ghost is! <laughs> it should have taken me that long to realize it, but it did. Okay, don't touch me. them a bit. He just waited for me to do that. Really.
please. God damn it. There's nothing, no, nothing I can do, really. I can do that, but that gives me... Oh, hit me. <laughs> Guess what? <laughs> yeah. oh. Okay, the hub was actually quite a nice stack pick if only for Crystals had appeared in the same age as the castle's fall, but they were not the cause of this destruction, merely an effect of it. There was something much darker here. Way to creep us out, Mr. Narrator. Oh, well, that's his job. Now that you can finally hear him. of the castle were quiet, almost serene, but within them still dwelled a great power. Here goes nothing, Dicey. Point It's a shame that we can't really upgrade our cards. Well, this game isn't long enough for it to be viable, I think. Yeah, but we're definitely not finishing the game today. Not a chance. Oh, look at this place. It is stunning. And it's been lived in recently. We're not alone here, Dicey. What do we have there? Wait, where will, will we be able to buy it? another cart? Give me a second. 
Yeah, I see you want to go down there. Or go up there. No, we need the we need a key over here. So we definitely need to go down there. But since I can still collect coins, that means we should be able to buy more cards. It gives me a headache. Whoa, she has a fleet of these things. That expecting concerning. Wait, Nanny Fortuna was coming. Quick, hide! Now, now! Hurry up, you scrumptious little children! What does scrumptious mean, miss? It means keep walking and stop asking questions! The one who dies does not like to wait! Where did I put my keys? Not again! Come on! That key's gotta be here somewhere! The key even was looking for. She just knew it had to be here somewhere. That wasn't Ugh, not your most helpful narration, bro. Okay, that was very unnecessary, and I and I have strange feeling that we won't be able to get back. Okay, now what was that for exactly? Really? It was kind of unnecessary. Okay, that was. You dealt a bad hand, have you? It was very necessary. <laughs> Cards on the table. This is a bit outside my normal rounds, and not at all what I was expecting. Yeah. But now Any you're the here. Queen. And many... Shh, mate, the Queen. Shh, Oh, don't. Mm -mm. What's that, mate? You want to trade cards? Don't mind if I do. You never know who's listening. Mm -hmm. Oh, so close. So, get them close. Really? Okay, here we go. All that we need was to climb the terrifying upper tower and face our destiny. Yeah, you're not in any danger here. Even, do you know what happens to a narrator if the person they're narrating dies? Uh, no. Me neither. Oh, but I'm sure it's not good. Okay, if he stays down there. Oh, he's fast. If he stays down there. <laughs> We really want such a small arena. Come on, come on. we can do this. Let's put it up. Entirely that kind of Locked over there. Oh god, not doing block anymore. So 
use these timers. Yep. Give me another one. Uh, I could use those to. Yes, I could. This is so good in the well. of me dodging into enemies. The yep. end? <laughs> no. Far from it. How much money do we have? I see it somewhere. Oh. Okay, let's try that again. Okay. That's a fine start, yeah. Yeah, great. Wonderful. Just... Prime. I think there's flying buggers. And that. That I never, ever get what I need. I always get hit by that. You know, nothing's getting hit, right? Please. Touch properly into them. Was why why did you do two attacks in a row? Thank you. Yes, I'm gonna play all of them. I can play all of them. Great, fantastic. This and do it like this. Yep. Very serious. Oh, oh did it die? Oh, it didn't. Throw some crystals so I can destroy them. Well, let's see this.
over here. Thank you. Come on. Okay, but never mind, that's gonna be it for today, so for now, thank you very much. Stay alive, and see you soon. Bye!